hi guys welcome back to the channel this is the second part of the AutoCAD Civil 3D learning lesson 3 video so let's move forward in this video I will explain the remaining points which is starting from point export in the previous video I have imported these points once we import these points these points came automatically to this group this is by default group the name of the group is all points in order to export the points right click on the all points and then click on export points so here i am giving the location of the file where i want to save the file click here i am pasting the location okay and i am giving the file name ogl2 you guys can see the location came here and also the file name the file name will be this one from here you can select the file format as per your requirement so in this case i want the format should be point number easting northing zenith elevation and description okay if you guys need different format you can select from here anyone then okay no system variable changed open the location you guys can see the file came here see all the points is exported 7547 the format is point easting northing elevation description close this file now I will teach how we can change the point style here go to the properties here I have select this basic okay here I have multiple options this point style is in the basic okay I want to change this point style from here to the benchmark click here and apply you can see the point style is changed to the benchmark style I am bringing back to the basic from here you guys can give different type of styles here I have multiple option for example I want to create a new point style from here I can create a new point style copy current selection for example I want to create the copy of the basic so I have to click here the third one is I want to edit in this point style so I can click on edit current selection so I will explain all of these first of all I have to create a new point style create a new information in the information I have to give the name new point style so I am changing the name one new point style and we can give the description here also I am not giving any description marker in this window we can change the size of the point style 0 0.5 apply ok you guys can see the size is goes to small this is automatically selected now now I want to change in the same point style so I have to edit bring back normal style size ok we can change it to the plus point style apply ok see edit again if you don't want the point style we can click here so we can see the number only but the point style will be not visible see edit again small points I need click ok the point style is become small like AutoCAD point edit so here we can convert it to the circle also edit again bring back to the normal now for example I want 
this point style like AutoCAD point style. So use AutoCAD point for marker. So it will be the same AutoCAD point. See, edit again. For example, I want the AutoCAD block used as a point style. So this is the option we can use it. These are the blocks which I have available in this file. Okay, but I am not using this one. Cancel. I am creating the new block, for example, REC. Small rectangle. Polyline. B enter pick the point I am giving the block name 1 ok I want to convert this block to the point style property added current selection click here use AutoCAD block the block name was 1 ok click here apply ok ok you guys can see the style of the points is same like a block if you change anything in the block the same changing will be happen in the point style also see I add the circle inside in the block so the same circle added in the point style. So like this we can give any kind of block as a point. Go to properties again. From here I can change the angle. For example I am giving the 90 degree. See 45. Apply OK. See the point style is rotated 45 degree. Bring back to the normal. In this window nothing have more important. If you guys have any question you can ask me. So I will answer it. The next is display. So we can see this point style here. So in the display we can change the layer, line type, scale, line width. For example, I want to change the layer of the marker. Click on layer. Here I can use any layer which I want. And for example, if I need a new one, create a new one, the new layer name will be 1, the color will be magenta, other things I have to keep it the same, ok, ok. So here, the color is selected by block, so I have to click by layer, the line type by block I have to keep it the same so the marker color will be this one in the plan ok apply see the color is changed bring back to the default again keep it as a block so the line type scale we can change it from here also I am keeping all the things same now apply ok apply now this is the summary we can see the summary from here the next is labeling for the labelings I will label all these points and whatever the data we have required we can annotate that data click on all points properties point label style 
click here for example i want to see the description of the points only click here apply and ok the description of these points was ogl so the ogl came here all again properties i am keeping this window here one side so i will apply only so no need to close again and again this window next elevation and description apply we can see the elevation and the description of the points it is not too nice i will adjust later on elevation only we can see the point elevation only easting and northing it is not looking nice i will adjust later on but we can see the northing and the easting like this with the point point number apply see we can see the point number after the point number we can see the point number elevation and description apply let me bring it to the clear area so you guys can see the clear picture of the points so you guys can see the point number elevation and description came here so the next is point number and description only okay so we can change the label like this properties again so now i have to adjust these sizes and everything for example i need the northing easting apply okay now i am adjusting the sizes and this text so it will be visible go to properties so now in order to adjust this i am not editing this one i have to create a new copy for this i am giving the name to okay apply so you guys can see this is the new one i make copy of this then edit in the general we can see here we have one window we can see the visibility of the points how it will look like okay here the point label and style and here point only i have to click it here in the labeling we can change text style here edit we can give the different styles okay by default it is on standard for example i want to keep the style here annotative then okay so the style will be changed we can create a new text style also for example how we can create the new text style d enter modify come to the text here the text style click it here create a new and the name i am giving the new new standard the font style i am giving the different apply okay back here edit click here so you guys can see the new standard came here click here okay you guys can see the text style which i created by my own that style came here i am keeping the standard one visibility i have to keep it in the true because i want to visible the uh, labels if we keep it false it will not be visible i have to keep it in the true so the layer name click here we can give the new layer or we can change it here for the new i click here new the layer name is node one other things we can change also the color i'm keeping this one okay line width everything we can change it here okay new one okay so the layer will come automatically in this one the behavior and plan visibility not for this time okay layout easting nothing this time adjusting only the size here so i came here the text height i am keeping 0.5 the size will come like this apply
the coordinate came here like this the gap between the point and the text is much so I have to reduce it came here 0 ok apply so the point is bigger than text so I have to reduce the size of the point also property 0.5 ok ok so now the text look good some area we have overlap but we can adjust it like this we can rotate ok click here rotate ok like this here for example I want to move the label I can move it also but this is not the common practice we are not doing like this ok reset again after mostly we are exploding these points after the exploding we have to adjust a little bit up and down we have to rotate or we have to do something like this ok so in the next video I will create the new style in detail where we will see multiple details point number Northing, Easting, Elevation, Description. So we will see these details like this here. So that's it for this video. If you guys have any question, you can comment me or you can send me the email. And you can comment me on the Facebook group. I will be happy to answer it. Thanks for watching. Bye.